Mambo vipi mpenzi mtazamaji wa L Media, Sauti TV, SPM Buzz, Madubi TV. Niko ndani ya Drip Press na niko na amazing one of the most talented producer we have in 254 Motive. Didon. Yes sir. Mambo vipi? Poa sana bro, poa sana. Na fly kukuona hapa kwenye Drip Press. Eh yeah, bro, lazima ningefika kwa kale ya watu wengine wanafanya ndio pia sisi tuanze kuifanya na sound yetu. Yes. All right, congratulations Motive Didon. Yesterday ulipata tuzo Sijui kama ni tuzo ya kwanza kwa maisha yako. Bro imagine for the first time in my career of uh, 10 years. Uongo. That's my first award. Hii Kenya yani kwa sijui kwa aje. But nashukuru manze ma fans finally at least wameona. Like pia ni waingilia kidogo nikwambia kuna hizi categories kidogo waangalia ma producer. So for the first time nilipata my first award in my career. After hizo hizo it's all it's all them chase here. That's my first time. But anyway iko iko about music. Ilikuwa about but at some point nilifika nikaanza nikaacha kufanya music nikajaribu kufanya something else influencing so like it makes sense at this point of my career cuz is my first year of influencing na ili come in handy yani at least imani boost yani yeah mimi kwa understand mbona ile kuchukua 10 years na mbona watu waje kwa appreciate for the last 10 years see ile watu wataki appreciate wasanii uh, producers and that's why juice ilikuwa nimeandika nikamwambia wasanii like Manze ku appreciate your own producers. Msipofanye hivyo no one else will, manze. But it is said, kila msia kuna producer wake, maju kwanza Nigerians. Ndezira ki ana mali ana beba producer wake, the whole team. Si ana beba cameraman peke yake, producer. Jo na jo yake ndo kwa lazima make sound. So like wasanii tu lazima anze kwa embrace your stuff. Hii kitu yani ishe tu na sisi yani like what was the I was and sisi kwa nimepata the first one in 10 years, manze. I make sense. But what do you want to say about the producers? Yes. But you know, what's the name? I was a two producers in Kenya. Maybe while I'm on a china on a sipper because, for example, Kaliga of a good school, where we will get out and up it. As a color, I manage like a baby of your view, like to say, make a man that two or Madu, I'm a somewhere, certain as a money baby. But that's what Nigerians do. Kama ukija Kenya unasikia si nani mobile amekuja na producer wake. So akikuja hapa vitu zinakuwa hizi. Si eti anakuja tena kungangana, kutafuta ma producer si wapi wapi. So like mkiwa hivyo na hiyo chemistry na your artist, mta make hits kila mahali mnaenda yani. Yeah. Sa so, motive uh, probably hapo uh, kwa ma DJ, uh, kwa ma producer na wasanii. Yeah. Do you think kwamba it is time to change the terms? Manake wasanii wengi wanafikiria kwamba akikuja umlipisha tuseme kama ni 50 Gs akisha kulipa yeah. ni mshamalizana unajua so there is no build up of relationship should we start building the relationship first before you as a happen ama tafanyaje hapo hiyo 50 set ya juu like yeah. okay pia ma producers pia waache kukaa kwa studio sana pia yeah. waanze kuzituma but pia kama ukifanya ngoma na msanii alafu unamwambia m collaborate na post yeah. like hiyo kitu like kila msanii alini dia maanambia by the way si peke yangu msanii anakataa like it makes sense yeah. Kozi yangu mani yenu inyo hili unajaribu ku build your own career, yeah. I mean your own fan base, yeah. yako na fan base yake, so unajaribu ku share. So akikata la like, ikaimek sense, sama yeah. i ana kupiga hizi, tufanya jioni, kesho, ai guys sipo. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, production ya Kenya sasa hivi, yeah. from where it is uh, back in the days, penye motive sound sahi. Juzi tumono kisema, it is about time to change sound. Tutoke genge ton, we have a new sound. Why do you think that is so? Na kwa nini unafikiria the new sound unataka kuleta sahi? Ok, kwanze yo post nilikuwa nimeka kama swali. Nilikuwa yeah. nimeuliza say, do you think yeah. wafa to rebrand genge ton? Yeah, true. So like me likuwa na joe, if I could rebrand you as you know, Gengeton, yeah. but I feel like it's about time we have something else. Yeah. Isema, to say that Gengeton ili isha nini, oh, asa ni wapi wamekuja to a brand, to a brand be different. Yeah. Kwa wanzu kena mahali meeting wese mawenu wafanya Gengeton, yeah. kuna venye room, unasikia ngatu, unanawasi wana kuangalia be different. Mm. So like, wafa to change zingine hani. So asa ni wapi wakikam, to wana to wapati another sound, urban tone, ama whatever it is, something different hani. Yeah. Sawa. So, uh, motive a few years back kama kama ni miezi uh, kulikuwa na ile Khalid alikuwa anafanya ile project yake yeah. you one of the guys from Kenya mwenye alipate kwa hiyo project uh, unaweza sema kwa career yako kama producer what is the biggest highlight na hiyo pia ilikufungulia nini kwa career yako kama music producer ah hiyo ni show biz for now but yeah. sasa kuna pesa eh kuna pesa eh like kuna jamii naenda kwa Akna Sony yeah. so like pia ilikuwa 
none of the ways like wase wanaweza kufanyia unajua wasanii pia Kenya nimesikia watu wa approach wanaambiwa wanasainiwa watu wanaogopa kusainiwa sana yani kila mzani mkubwa wa Afrika si amesainiwa kina Davido kina Wizkid watu wako Sony so Afrika Kenya pia watu wasiogope sana deal si lazima tu sign for 10 years unaweza kupatia publishing deal something enye wanakuweka kwa map so like pitia wa association ya Sony association ya Sony that's only limit like someone like DJ Khaled so like wana kona wasanii wote there's wanaweza ku link up very easily yeah kwa kwa signing bana yeah. wasanii wengi ambao wenye kwa mkataba sasa hii tukija kuangalia wasanii kama all the groups by the they is going to get on zilingia into record deals na hapo ndio ilikuwa like their shining stars zilianza kukua dima hapo yeah. alafu there are some of the artists wenye walikuwa me sign sasa hii wanajaribu kutoka in the name that wanakuwa wananyanyaswa na zile label so you for you manaka hapa una advocate for people to be signed Ami nasema ukita ukisainiwa usign the right deal. Yeah. Si usainiwe tu juu watu wengine wanasainiwa. Watu wanasainiwa for 10 years mahali ujangalia hizo terms. Naomba kama ni publishing deal, yani kuna so many ways kwa kuna wase. Yeah. Inaweza kuwa ni distribution. Si ati lazima ufu, eh, lazima uangalie kitu before usign. Yeah. Otherwise utaingia hapo, u realize later. Sasa unakuwa depressed, unakuwa unataki kutoa music, unangojea deal itoke. By the time hiyo 5 years ishe pia umeisha. So lazima tu kupitia kuwe na lawyer. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hapo sawa. So wasanii wanaweza jituma. What will you say is the biggest highlight of your music or your career kama music producer sai? 10 years in the industry speaking. Hey. Hapa <laughs> Kenya mazeri no. Hey, I feel bad. Mimi na feel kazi ime kit song yani bado. Until siku nitakuwa na hit song ya Africa at least. Kenya ni ndogo yani. So ile siku nitakuwa na hiyo hit song ya Africa about to have your conversation. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> about it. Umesema una highlights ya 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 the Kenyans in the industry. It is so sad as as Kenyans to hear stories that our Kenyan music, your good work as a producer, the hit you produce, they don't get a chance even a single play in Nigeria. What is it we're doing wrong up to now? We don't get air plays in Nigeria. Kuna kitu nilianzisha ni Elevate Africa. So najaribu kuonyesha wase, sorry. Najaribu kuonyesha wase kuna talent tunaweza export. So unajua nasema ngawa sana wako saizi apart from a few. Tunaza hakuna talent. So nimejaribu kuonyesha like let's work with these guys. Imagine like sema kama kiss, kiss a fellow. Washikia msanii mmoja, wasema let's make a whiskey out of this guy. Wanaweza shindwa. Ni pesa tu na hiyo exposure. Wanaweza shindwa. So wasanii wako niyo tu like hakuna Watu take your leo nini. Hatuwezi kuwa na this kind of siko baya but this is a house. Mbona tusikisikiza ngoma zetu like uh, make this kind of uh, events. So that's why pia ni kwa hapa ni land wasi wanafanya nini? Ionekane sana na with this new crop of artists. Yeah. Bila bila because kumekuwa na wasanii ambao wanakuja na wave. Yeah. Sorry to say a few names like the likes of Wangeshi Wange Wangeshi Wange Wangekehe. Wangeshi kwanza nyinyi ndo mli make Alafu na alafu na nani? Watu wapate wapate clicks on YouTube. Nilikuwa na hata nisha comment. Like si kwa baya lakini kuna sani wengi wa noma sana. Mbona msiendea wasanii wakali mnajua msi tunaweza mu export. Mnaendea msanii kwanza mki watu wakimcheka. Unacheka huu msi hata si mkali. Unajua tu si si kwa baya. But kuna sani wakali mkishika hivi mkono bro. Hai ni hivyo. Mmoja tu ukiweza shika mmoja nyewe wasi wa online. Hai <laughs> ndio ilikuwa game I saw ilikuwa hivyo au kuna jua ilikuwa hivyo eh like ilikuwa tu ile clicks mimi niambia wase hata ni sai post ni plan like kuna sai wa noma mbona msisupport wase wa noma mnajua ni wa noma wa noma wa noma tunaweza export tuseme tupushu mse yeah si ati si mnoma by the kitu moja by the wasanii wakuja kwa studio si 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 za artist because wezi jua kuna wasanii wengi wa size si hawana talent ya kuimba but wako kwa jua kuna pesa zao like wanajua business so like ile ku dismiss mse pia sipo eh unampatia tu chance alafu bidii yake ndio inamfikilisha inampeleka kwa juu yeah sawa unajua one of the things umekuwa ukitumia sahii 
ni Instagram and all that hizo mitandao zote na tunaona una post a lot of talents zenye zina image na nini yeah. are you planning probably to sign some of these talents zenye unaeka kwa mtandao ama hizi talents what is the end game na hizi talents una to expose ya so kuna couple of uh, corporates nimejaribu kuongea nao Kenya lakini sasa naona vitu ziko slow Zwa watu wengine wa believe in producers hata nikwambia kitu moja yeah. ile siku asio hata endos producers hapo ndio game ita change yeah kwanza nikwati example like maju yeah. tunajua dr dre yes dre one of the biggest yeah, like actually pesa hapo ndio mlitoa alitoa kina mimi na kina 50 cent si hawa sasa hawa ni wote wa bigi walitoka through dr dre yes angalia someone like don jazzy in nigeria yeah akia anaekelewa like some funding alafu anatoa wasani so mbona tusifanye the same hapa kenya eh eh hiyo ndio kitu najaribu kufanya yani yeah okay sasa wacha tu hope kwamba so sasa hii uko na talent wangapi wenye una bank account unasema tukipata funding na unaweza penda uko collab na kina nani wengi tu hii ni nini okay na kuona ingia elevate africa on instagram utaangalia wasanii ni wengi just pick your favorite hapo to support pia si kama online community mfanye fanye una tikifanya mle fanya kazi mbeka zote sani moja tu mpange hivyo one kuna msanii anaitwa Bueno by the way ni Bueno yeah eh mbona sana mbona msimfanye hivyo eh excuse gani excuse gani hapa sidhani kama kuna excuse hapo why eh there is a good challenge actually just one wish to the Kenya one eh mbona there is a good challenge maybe a message to your fans my fans manze watu walionipotia nashukuru sana hiyo category ilikuwa na wasanii wengi sana by the way wengi nataka kuwak nao kama Ethan sio yuak nae by the way leo ndio alikuwa anasikiza music zake hakokuwa sana so like thanks a lot fans manze nashukuru the first award in 10 years silie manze silie mama sasa super model asante bro asante